If you're thinking about staining a fence, here's a few tips for you. Now if the fence is new, you can go straight on and put a nice water-based oil stain like we've got over here, or a Resine Woodsman penetrating oil stain of the colour of your choice. The great thing about using these water-based oil stains, it's really easy to clean up, just use water. Stir the tin regularly as the pigments generally sink to the bottom. Now there are a couple of different tools that you can use to apply the stain. You can use a roller like this, the good thing about this is it's got an 8mm nap on it. What that means is that's going to soak up loads of the stain and so when you're applying to a rough sawn fence it's going to get great coverage. You can also get one of these nice little Fence Master combo packs, really nice big wide 100mm brush and with a little cutting in one there as well. It's going to paint on really nice and easy, it's going to load the brush up with loads of stain as well. Or you can go with a brush like this, it's nice and fat, that's also going to pick up loads of stain and it's going to get great coverage and it's not going to take too long. Now you can also use a roller with an extension pole if you have a high fence. You can stand back and get some good action rolling that out. If your fence is a little bit older and it does have a bit of moss and mould and dirt on it, you are going to need to treat it before you stain. So you'll need to mix up some moss and mould killer, apply that and let it dry and then apply some timber and deck wash once again, then let it dry. Or you can go straight onto this roof and exterior prep, mix that up with water as well and let it dry and then put on your top coat of your stain. Now here's a quick painting tip for you. Before you nail your palings to the fence, you might want to stain or paint the edges of them before you put them up. That way you don't have to worry about trying to fiddly cut in later. So what I like to do is put all my palings together, either stacked up or laid out, and take a roller and just paint all those edges in one go and then that way you can nail them to the fence and then just paint the face a little bit later. That way you're going to speed your job up no end. So there's a few tips that'll get you painting like a pro. Now grab your brushes and get into it.